A small group of demonstrators were protesting outside the inquest. Their campaign aimed against the operation which Lena Zavaroni had received, but an operation the inquest was told that she had pleaded for herself. For 23 years, the singer who rose to stardom at the age of 10 had struggled against anorexia nervosa. It was a battle she never won, and in the years immediately preceding her death, she was also fighting depression. Instead of either turning to something like young people, sometimes they'll, they'll turn to punk or drugs or drink or whatever. I just actually turned it all on to my favorite thing, which was food. At the University Hospital of Wales, where she had her operation, the inquest heard the surgery was aimed at relieving her depression, not the anorexia. Consultant neurosurgeon Brian Simpson, who left the inquest in the back of a police car, said she'd wanted the operation for months. He said that in February she seemed to clearly understand what it meant, but that she had taken an overdose shortly before the operation, and she'd made it quite clear to him that if she couldn't have the operation quickly, she would kill herself. Lina Zavaroni's family questioned whether it was right to operate when she was so underweight, but the inquest heard she'd responded well, dying from an unrelated chest infection, although she weighed just four stone. Ironically, after her operation, she'd been talking about a comeback. Tim Rogers, ITN, Cardiff.